Now, ABC 7 News at 11, on your side. Dueling demonstrations in the nation's capital tonight. White nationalists greeted by counter protesters at their rally one year after deadly riots in Charlottesville. Only two arrests connected to a day that at, ten, at times got tense. Victoria Sanchez was in the crowd during those heated moments. She's live at Lafayette Park with more on our top story. Sounds like things have quieted down quite a bit tonight, Victoria. A much quieter scene here in front of the White House in Lafayette Park. However, there are still Secret Service officers and police officers making sure that this remains peaceful for the rest of this Sunday night. Unite the Right demonstrators and organizer Jason Kessler were met with jeers and signs protesting the so-called white civil rights rally. We can't ignore racism. Right? One man was arrested as the white nationalists made their way to the metro train. When the group of only about a dozen people arrived in Washington, D.C., a crowd was waiting. Back up! Back up! The Unite the Right group just left the Foggy Bottom Metro Station. There are thousands of counter-protesters and hundreds of police officers. The mass of people marched about a mile to the White House. I can't stand to see people hate each other. Unite the Right was escorted to Lafayette Park, where Kessler gave a reason for his smaller-than-expected crowd of supporters. Uh, there are a lot of people who would have loved to have been here today, but were afraid for their safety, were afraid for their freedom. Outside the protest barriers, the crowd grew. Members of Antifa and Black Lives Matter covered their faces as they protested the white nationalist event. I feel like it's ridiculous that it's happening at all. The crowd briefly turned on police, throwing eggs, sticks, and sending fireworks over barriers. After the rally, one smaller group of protesters was pepper sprayed. Did they say why we sprayed you? No one here was arrested as the crowds dwindled. Now, I asked that person who was pepper sprayed if he was in the street or in the sidewalk when Metropolitan Police officers sprayed a group of about three to four people with pepper spray, and he said he did not want to answer. Right now, it is quiet in front of the White House as counter-protesters and the members of the Unite the Right group have left the nation's capital. Live in front of Lafayette Park, Victoria Sanchez, ABC 7 News.